Hey guys, so in today's video, I'm going to show you how to fix notification sound problem on iOS 17. So with the latest update of iOS 17, a lot of people are complaining about their notification sound. So I'm going to show you how to fix that in this video. So the first thing you need to make sure is that your iPhone is not on silent mode. So for most people, their iPhone might be, might be on silent mode, maybe because you removed your case or something like that. Just make sure your iPhone is not on silent. So for most people, the silent button is beside their iPhone. So just turn it off. Turn off your silent. Sorry. Let me delete this screenshot. So just turn off your iPhone silent. The second thing you can do is to head over to your settings. If you don't want to turn off your silent with your side button, you can just scroll down to accessibility. Click on touch. Click on assistive touch at the top. So let me turn off my Bluetooth. So you are going to enable this assistive touch. Once you enable assistive touch, click on it and you are going to see device. Click on device and you are going to see this mute button. So if you click on it, it's going to mute your device. It's going to enable the silent. And if you click on it, it's going to turn off your silent mode. So just turn it off like this and you can now turn off your assistive touch back. So I am using it for my mouse. Sorry. So let me go back. The next thing you can do is to head over to your settings and you need to click on notification. Once you click on notification, look for the app that you are facing issue with the notification sound. So let's just use Facebook for an example. Once you select Facebook, you need to toggle on this sound. So if your sound is turned off, just make sure it is turned on. And for these three options, make sure all these three options are enabled also because Maybe when you update your iPhone, one has turned off because there will be some bugs in the iOS 17. Just make sure these three options are turned on already. And after that, you need to select the sound for your notification. So let's look for the announce notification and you need to enable this announce notification also. So I think it's going to be using the default notification sound for your iPhone. So notification grouping so just make sure all the settings are just like this in this video just make sure everything is set up like this so the next thing you can do is if you have did if you have done some things with the app settings and you don't know how to go back you can just clear the app cage and redownload it so maybe you have toggled off something in the app settings and you don't know how to go back to it and turn it back on just head over to your settings scroll down to general Click on iPhone storage and you need to look for the app that is giving you problem with your notification. So let's say my own is WhatsApp. Just click on WhatsApp and you need to offload it. So by offloading it, it's going to keep the document and data on the app. So you don't need to worry about that. Just offload the app and you need to reinstall it after the uploading process. Let me look for app that doesn't take much space. So I'm just going to show you how to offload it and install it back. So let's make use of this one as an example. Let's make use of ChatGPT. Just offload the app. And once you offload the app, you are going to see the install option. Just reinstall it back to your device. And that's it. It's going to fix any issue you are having with your notification. So guys, just try all what I explained in this video. It's going to fix that. Fix back your notification sound. If you found this video helpful, smash the like button and subscribe to my channel. More amazing videos like this. Peace.